So this week, got a real treat. Um, I had the opportunity to interview Trey Scott from Microsoft, and he works in the Future of Work department there. And um, my colleague Natalie Hall connected me there. We went to college together. So uh, we talk about a lot of things. It was talked every th about everything from artificial intelligence to the future of work to organizational evolution, but try to clip out some interesting things around how organizations learn, grow, and evolve over the course of time and how we see that shifting in the future and how that's accelerating. So uh, hopefully you'll find this topic thought-provoking. Hey, testing. Can testing, good morning. All right. The human race has been part of an evolutionary process, right? Like, and the only way we evolve is actually through a learning process. Learning process in the beginning of time it has to do with like the transference of knowledge. I, and I believe, I, I think that our rate of evolution has accelerated due to the fact that we have more data and analytics and all sorts of stuff. The rate of evolution, there's individuals, let's say there's teams and there's orgs, analog world, right? Which is like really slow. Print. We had like nodes of information, right? Books and stuff that one source, everybody kind of circled around those books and some people like had that and then disseminated to like maybe orgs and there's communities. And then like we got to lands in the nineties and then like CD-ROMs and, you know, being able to share across like a closed community. And then now we're in like, like the network data component here. Data was very minimal along these lines and all of a sudden like data expanded and so it's creating evolution that's at a faster rate in these areas. Humans have been in that evolutionary process since the beginning of time. The rate in which we evolve is at a much faster rate than we've ever been before. We're learning actually tremendously fast. We're learning so fast we can't keep up and actually the artificial intelligence guys are take some of the basic learnings that that's right, right? How we envision in the next couple decades, how people will evolve and how organizations will be evolved is interesting. And like in WeWork is kind of an interesting example, a modern network environment. Yes. To your point, they, yeah. lived, they were built in this space. Yeah. I mean, they're similar to any, but take a step back, right? You sort of have like, you know, companies that are born in the age of AI. Yeah. So I think my whole point is that you're right. We're sort of in this space and there is a future, but there's also like and the ability to be able to measure and use this yeah. information to propel to the next. Because yeah. part of what we were using here was to understand more information to your point, yeah. and therefore we were able to learn better and faster. Yeah. You have organizations who say, well, we work very well together. Yeah. So, well, this group works very well together. Yeah. They have no clue what's happening with the rest yeah. of the company, right? It's that like you bring along your experiences here to this. Yeah. Right? And so you see the behaviors of an individual yeah. and how they interact with the world being brought to more life, church, death, right? Um, and so we, we can look at it. So who are you examining with today? How different is that in 12 months? Right after this meeting, I had a team meeting and they won't let me in because I'm videotaping and they don't want to be on YouTube. So, well, too bad. What's up, everyone? I'm here to announce this week's winner of the Education Elements. Nope. This time it sucks. So this week's winner is Cynthia Haddock in Kansas. Thank you so much, Cynthia, for signing up for the newsletter. Uh, really appreciate you being a member of the community to learn more about different practices and habits and ways for your team and the organization to learn. Like I always say, don't compare your insides with other people's outsides. Peace. Oh, that's our swag. That's just like stickers that we have. Oh, it's only you make this happen. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <A> brainer. <laughs>